welcome back. In this uh, video we are going to work uh, a little bit on our navbar and uh, we are going to add uh, a footer to our uh, blog. So uh, let's get to it. Basically what I want to do first is to let's exit this is to create the, the footer. So let's uh, do an, uh, a new file. Let's save it. Let's say footer.blade.php like so and uh, inside the footer uh, basically what do we uh, we want we just want uh, a little uh, title and uh, and uh, that's basically it so let's do do it like so div div would be with a class of uh, let's say uh, co and the eight and an offset let's place it in the middle co md offset of uh, four like so and let's do it with an h4 and uh, let's say mm, the best blog Like so, and uh, you can uh, be creative uh, with this, <laughs> uh, whatever you want. Let's say div of uh, let the class would be just to place a nice uh, HR in here, call MD12, and in here let's place uh, a nice HR. We can save it. We can go into our layouts file dot app, and uh, what we want to do is to include this uh, layouts. So beneath the the content, let's uh, uh, let's include include um, what the partials dot footer. And uh, let's see what that gives us. It should be okay. The best blog, as you can see, it is. Um, it will. Right here, it uh, it's going to be dynamic as you put your. Uh, your uh, more post and uh, and uh, all that uh, things it will uh, go down or go up basically this is the end of your uh, of your page so uh, it's working uh, quite nicely we can add a little uh, something uh, like here the best blog uh, let's say all rights reserved damn it 2016 like so and uh, we can give it a nice uh, style uh, of uh, color let's say red whatever you want you can do let's change it like so all the best blog all right result gamut 2016 and uh, we are done with the footer and uh, what uh, we need to do now is to work on our uh, on our uh, navbar. So we can go ahead and work on our navbar in our partials navbar. What we want to do is to display some uh, links. So uh, we can uh, basically paste this right like so, and if it is like so, and uh, right above here. We can copy this, we can paste it here, and uh, let's see. We want our comments. No, comments will be later. We want our uh, our categories, and we want uh, our uh, our tags for now. And the the index uh, page, but uh, this we have. 
so let's change uh, a little something uh, in here this let's say class of um, let's open up double query braces like so and uh, we'll say request is uh, and uh, what we want if request is uh, tags like so then we want it uh, to be active right so we can do it like so and uh, we'll say active like so like this active if not we'll say uh, nothing so this uh, will uh, work on uh, on everything so and uh, what we want is the route the proper route let's say route uh, we're going to say tags.index route of tags dot of index like so it should work fine in here uh, tags let's copy this copy we can delete this one and let's say category ca where is it ca categories dot index if categories is active then uh, we want it to be active so let's see what that gives us in here oh what is this unexpected like so okay I just had uh, a little uh, I had uh, this in here so we don't need this in here that's okay that's fine let's change this to categories categories like so we can save it and let's go here refresh and it will say categories and uh, and tags like so it will bring us into our tags this will bring us into our categories and uh, we are uh, good to go on the that part so uh, basically what uh, we're going to do in the next videos is to add the uh, comments is to add uh, a lot of uh, cool uh, things and uh, we can add uh, our favorites a person can uh, go ahead and uh, and favorite a post and it will save it into his uh, favorites uh, page and uh, a lot of uh, nice things so uh, be sure to subscribe and uh, i'll see you in the next video bye bye